So let's take a big breath together. And as you breathe in, you can close your eyes and just start to drop into your breath. Just check in with where you're at in this moment, the beginning of the week, this evening. And of course, your thoughts might wander. And that's totally natural. And of course, you know, your mind might be full of different images and memories from the course of the day. But I just encourage you to come back to the breath. And before we start to really start to deepen the breath, just see where your breath's at right now. Just notice maybe the length of your breath. Notice what you feel like you're breathing into. And also just be aware of where you feel the breath might be a little constrained, a little tight, or even blocked. And we're not looking to change anything now. And we're not even looking to judge it. We're just trying to be open, just being aware of where our breath is. And as we deepen our awareness of where the breath is, we can start to deepen the breath itself. So what I'd encourage you on this next inhale, see if you can make it slightly longer than you normally would. Maybe one or two extra beats before you drop into your exhale. And then as you finish the exhale, just pause for a moment. Sometimes this can be uncomfortable before you bring in your next breath. See if you can find those pauses at both the beginning and the ending of each breath. And see if you can make those pauses a little longer, not too long, just an extra moment or two longer than you normally would. And just very intentionally bringing in the next breath and then exhaling the previous one. And as you do that, I'd encourage you to just start to let go of the breath again for a moment and let it be long. Imagine it being slow. Really picturing it deepening. So one way to deepen your breath is see if you can draw your breath from the center of your core. Rather than breathing through your mouth, feel yourself breathing beneath your heart. Imagine you're pulling that breath down through the heart space. And if you want, you can even explore that in other parts of your body and you can go even deeper, imagining you're breathing down through your legs. Really feeling the breath moving to these parts of your body, these parts of your being with intentionality. And then rather than starting with the head today, let's drop all the way down to our feet, following that breath and your awareness to the bottom of your feet. Whether they're cross-legged or they're seated on the ground, really feel your feet in that sense of connection to the earth. Whatever that may be, a tailbone or an arch or a heel. And just for a few moments, just take a couple breaths with your feet, almost feeling yourself breathing up through the bottom of your feet. I like to sometimes imagine like my feet are resting on just a, a warm orb of light. And you can feel that energy rising up into your feet and notice the breath as it moves through your feet. Feel it in your toes. Feel it at the back of your feet. Feel it on top of your feet. And as you deepen your breath, you can almost imagine your feet just sinking into the ground, just totally releasing and relaxing. And allow the breath to rise even higher, maybe up through your ankles, 
to your shins and your calves. And as the breath begins to rise, just notice what you feel, any areas that are sticky or blocked, maybe in your knees, in your thighs, the length of your legs, really feeling the weight of all the places your legs have been. And take a couple deep breaths, just honoring that feeling the fullness of your legs. And then as you exhale, just letting them go as well. Almost like sand blowing away in the wind. And as you do that, come back to that breath at the base of your spine. Sometimes we bury our emotions, especially emotions around fear and anxiety in our core. So I'd encourage you to breathe up through this space very gently, very softly. And you can almost imagine some of those emotions being sticky or tarry within your being. And just bring the breath into those spaces. And sometimes the breath is enough to unstick them and sometimes you're just creating space around them. And as you breathe in and your breath grows even higher, begin to feel the breath as it comes up into your lungs and your heart. Feel a real deep sense of your breath in your lungs, almost opening wings on your back. As you breathe in, just feel your lungs expand wider and broader and bigger than they've ever expanded. Feel your heart too open and fill with the breath, with that energy. And then as that deepens and grows, let the breath come up into your shoulders, feeling your shoulders rise on the inhale, feeling your arms relax on the exhale. You can let the breath go all the way down your arms to your fingers, to the tips of your fingers, feeling almost a tingling sensation. And then taking another breath and just letting your arms go, letting your shoulders go and bringing your breath into your neck and your jaw. Can carry so much tension in our jaw and just take a couple full breaths, just letting your jaw and your tongue and your mouth relax. All the things maybe that you said or didn't say, just letting that all go. And inviting the breath now up into your ears, up into your brow, up into your mind. And just like we explored all those parts of our body, just notice those parts of your mind. Some of those thoughts just feel very present, very sticky, very dominant. And just picture them either like rocks or piles of sand and take another breath and just let them blow away. And just with a few deep inhales, let your mind just clear just like a dune on the beach, changing and smoothing. Let the weight of your head just totally dissolve. And as it dissolves, let yourself drop back into your heart. And I'd let yourself go now with your imagination to some place where you feel very safe, very comfortable. Maybe that's a place in nature, maybe it's in your home, your real heart space. And if you didn't light a candle or you did, just picture a candle in that space with you. And I want you to take a couple deep breaths, really feeling the breath and almost watching that candle expand and contract with the breath. What I'd like you to do is invite someone within your life who might need breath 
and space and healing into this space. Let the first thought be the right thought. Just let whoever comes to mind enter this space with you. And as they enter this space, you can almost picture them across from you, across from this candle. And as they watch the candle and they feel your breath, they too begin to breathe. They feel that energy. It's as if your breath becomes their breath. And it's a very expansive feeling, like those big wings opening up. And if you'd like, you can invite another person into this space with you. And this person too might need something, maybe an emotional healing or a physical healing. And I'd ask you for this third person, invite someone maybe who you don't know. Maybe for a moment, invite those people who are really struggling to breathe at this moment. Invite those people into this space, maybe who you know or don't know, who the breath is, is very present, but very difficult. And almost imagine that you could breathe for them. And really feel that openness and that expansiveness. And then before we open our eyes, letting go of those three people, imagine yourself in the circle with all of us here tonight, breathing. Really appreciating our breath, maybe for the first time in a long time. We're really setting that intention of not just breathing for ourselves, but breathing for this planet. Breathing for all of those who are suffering, who are scared, who are alone. And feel that sense of connection and how powerful your breath truly is. And when you're ready, just taking a few breaths, still with your eyes closed, come back into the space where you first began this meditation. Feel the weight of your feet and the weight of your hands, but also still with your eyes closed, just notice your breath. Notice how maybe it's changed or shifted. Notice what you feel, what you notice. And maybe set an intention that this week, whether it's the beginning of the day, the middle of the day, or the end of the day, just really taking some deep, full breaths. And then when you're ready, you can wiggle your toes and your fingers, and you can gently open your eyes.